Coronary heart disease is the UK's number one killer, resulting in over 80,000 deaths a year and costs the NHS in excess of £3 billion. Six out of ten UK adults carry the biggest modifiable risk factor, elevated cholesterol levels. The UCLP is a revolutionary approach to help the nation's ailing hearts and alleviate the current NHS economic burden. I worry enormously about the state of the health of this nation. We know that obesity and lifestyle contribute enormously to raised cholesterol and we know that raised cholesterol is probably the single biggest risk factor for heart disease. I do think that the government should be looking at putting more emphasis on helping people to help themselves with respect to their diet because in terms of public health and the population that would make a vast difference. We know that when people adopt a lifestyle rather than going on a diet that they can come off, that they can make huge differences. We also know that taking several different food groups individually proven to lower cholesterol and adding them together can have a much bigger impact. The biggest issue we've had in the past is getting people to stick with it. With the UCLP you combine evidence with motivational interviewing. That means that nurses can help patients to identify their own triggers, can help patients to choose for themselves what they're going to do. And I'm really confident because of studies we've had in the past that that will help patients stick with this and make a real long-term difference. I would love to see the UCLP taken up really widely by practice nurses in particular who do a fantastic job in helping patients. We could make a vast difference to the population of this country, but it's really important that patients work together with the healthcare professionals who will be helping them to use it and who will be helping them to stick with the changes. Diet is a real co cornerstone for cholesterol reduction. And the ultimate cholesterol lowering plan, the UCLP, has the potential to be even better than other dietary regimes. There are three main reasons. Firstly, the science. Secondly, the flexibility. And thirdly, the use of motivational interviewing. In terms of the science, every single element of the ultimate cholesterol lowering plan has a heart health benefit. And there are five specific cholesterol lowering parts of the diet. Firstly, the reduction in saturated fat. Secondly, the adoption of soy protein. Thirdly, nuts. Fourthly, the use of soluble fibre in the diet. And fifthly, the use of plant sterols and plant stannols. Now, each of those elements individually has the ability to lower cholesterol by about 5%. But when you add them together, and this is where the flexibility comes in, uh, you can get up to 20 or even 30% cholesterol reduction. That's almost as much as a first generation statin. And thirdly, the motivational interviewing. This is where the healthcare professional is key because it's their role to explore with the patient their reasons, their motivations for wanting to lower their cholesterol and also for exploring with the patient the barriers that they might have to making these changes and helping them overcome those barriers in a supportive and encouraging and perhaps challenging way. Statins prescribed alongside other lifestyle intervention programmes are a safe and powerful therapy for lowering cholesterol and reducing coronary heart disease in patients at high risk of cardiovascular disease. One of the key findings of the UCLP report is that strategies to significantly improve compliance for both statin and lifestyle interventions are paramount if we're to improve the nation's health outcome. The UCLP desktop flip chart and its accompanying patient information sheets are a really useful tool for healthcare professionals to use when advising patients on how to lower cholesterol. It provides all the latest evidence and research in a very practical, visually appealing way. It's a really exciting tool and it's a breath of fresh air because we really need something to standardise dietary advice and help patients lower cholesterol and reduce their incidence of heart disease. The UCLP offers a life-saving and cost-saving practical and realistic solution to the nation's ailing heart, reducing coronary heart disease risk by 6 to 24%. Adopting the UCLP into NHS Health Check screening programme has the potential to save the NHS in excess of £19 million. It's time to place the UCLP on the national agenda.